Good morning. It's going to be 60 degrees today, and I'm going to go out and uh, sweep out my vehicle, get all the salt from the snow out of my vehicle. But right now, I'm making breakfast. Some eggs. And I got my griddle here heating up. So, I'm going to mix these up and get some breakfast in me. Go outside and start clean, getting stuff ready to clean the car. So, it's going to be an interesting day again. Yeah. The eggs that I'm using are fresh eggs. A guy at work gave them to me. And I've never had fresh eggs. So here they are cooking on my uh, griddle. And well, I'm just getting set up with all my stuff for the, to sweep my car and clean out my car. I've got my little shop back. And I brought these crevice tools from the uh, house sweeper. I want to see if they attach to the sweeper. I know this one here uh, does for sure because I used this one before. It has the little bristles on the end. And the uh, products I'm going to use are carpet cleaner. I got two cans of that. And then I got an awesome to spray like on the dash and stuff. Get the dirt. So I got some dirt where uh, my feet go. Like right here. There's some dirt. There's some dirt. You can tell it has some salt and stuff from where the salt trucks put salt down and you get in and out of the car. So I'm going to go ahead and clean it up. Sweep it out so it'll start rusting my car or ruining the carpets. Well, I had to run into a little bit of difficulties. Hooked the shop back up. It ran for 30 seconds and quit. So I think it's pretty much shot. It's all right. I have a backup. It's just a little Craftsman one gallon. So it's it'll be enough to do what I want to do today. But I really like my shop back that I got from Lowe's. It's a uh, six gallon, three horsepower. So I'm gonna have to buy me a new one or something. This one don't start working. Spray some of that carpet cleaner on the seats. Uh, some of it's already soaked in and cleaning. And once it uh, the suds dissipate, um, you let it dry and then you vacuum it. I did it there, and a little spot here. It was like under the seat. It was kind of like dirty. And it's a little dirt spot right there too. I don't know if you can see it very well. But I'll put some on it, and uh, I'm gonna spray the dash down with this here, and uh, wipe it down with a wet cloth or damp cloth. I did right here. You can see how shiny it is. Stuff works pretty awesome, just like the name. This here is uh, just air freshener. So but it's coming, coming. On along pretty good I'll spray some awesome right there get all that dirt off that mat little mat part and uh, do the dash and the doors doors ain't that bad this was probably the worst because I put my arm and stuff up here this door is the worst you can tell by the speakers there's mud on it so this is what it looks like right now and I'll apply some of that at awesome to it and let it sit for a few minutes and wipe it down with a damp cloth and then I'll show you the, the after.
All right, so if I wiped the dash down with that awesome spray and some water, it came uh, pretty clean actually. So to put some protection back on the dash from the sun and the doors, I'm going to use this all protection. Um, protects leather and vinyl surfaces. And all these products that I'm using today that you saw came from the Dollar Tree. Uh, when you're putting like armor all or any kind of like protectant on vinyl you, in, the, in your car especially you don't want to put it on the steering wheel because it makes it slippery and you, you need the steering wheel to have like a grip After wiping down the dash, the doors, and the door jams, this is what the water looks like. I'm going to pour it over here in the snow so you can actually see where I had that fire. But watch. Yeah. Good. So it wasn't too dirty, but it needed clean. Now I have a clean car. Finished inside the car and it smells wonderful. And it looks great. Um, so I worked up a little appetite but I'm really not hungry for like a big meal. So I've uh, heated up some East, um, pepperoni rolls. These are... Uh, I'm not real sure what who makes these. Um, Here's the package. Uh, but after I eat, give me a shower and then call it a day. Kick back and relax. So we'll talk to you guys later.